What's up everyone, Takedown here. Welcome back to another Flipping for Profit video. Today I'm going to be sharing with you something that I picked up to flip and resell that should be able to get some pretty decent profit. Let's get right into this. <music> So here we go. It is this Xbox 360 lot that I did just purchase. I was going to talk about this PS2 lot and something that I picked up from Crazy Bins, but you guys are going to have to wait for another video for that. So this Xbox 360 lot includes a Xbox 360 Elite console that has 500 gigabytes. I just checked here. And the controller looks like it is in great condition. Obviously, I don't have it sitting out right now. It does have the power cord, HDMI cord. And it does actually have two mics with it, which is very, very interesting. So it did include this and 76 video games, which all of the discs, discs are there. I already checked. And we're just going to quickly go through them as quickly as I can, um, starting with this pile here. So we have Assassin's Creed Rogue, Assassin's Creed 3, Assassin's Creed Brotherhood, Kanan Lynch, which I haven't seen in years, Fable uh, 2 and 3, Max Payne 3, Mafia 2, Gears of Wars 2, Crisis 2, uh, we've got Prototype 1 and 2, Bioshock 1, 2, and Infinite, Mass Effect 1, 2, and 3, which is awesome whenever you have a uh, series like that, we have Far Cry 2, three and four we have saint rose saint rose two that doesn't have the cover on it saint rose three and four and we have borderlands and borderlands the prequel i have this one set out separately this is dante's inferno i actually sold this one that's why i left it out because i know what i sold it for i sold this one for 15 dollars itself a while back so i should be able to get 15 dollars out of this game UFC Undisputed 2009, NBA 2K16, WWE 2K16, Evil Within, Call of One Eras, probably butchered that, Dishonored, Halo 4, the only Halo game in this lot, which Halo does good with Xbox, so I was expecting more, uh, Left 4 Dead, Left 4 Dead 2, Star Wars The Force Unleashed, I'll have to check that one out, South Park The Stick of Truth, fun, fun game. Uh, Portal 2, Sonic Sega All-Stars, have to check that one out, and Dead Rising, we have L.A. Noir, uh, Sleeping Dogs, GTA 5, Destiny, Watch Dogs, Mortal Kombat, uh, Red Dead Redemption, Skyrim, Dragon Age 2, which I sold a bunch a while back, uh, Soul Calibur 4, Saboteur, Time Shift, uh, Vanquish, Dark Sector. Some of these ones, this pile here, uh, is ones that I just haven't heard of. Uh, Bullet Storm, Epic Edition, Sneak King, and Face Breaker. So some of the ones that I never hear of are ones that sometimes are profitable, so I'll have to look up sold comps for those. These ones here, I'm not going to go through... There are a bunch of shooter games, Battlefield, Rainbow Six, Call of Duty, Medal of Honor, a bunch of games like that. And then I have some more shooters here, Battlefield, Call of Duty, and two that were not in discs, which I do have spare discs in the other room, uh, Lego Marvel Super Heroes and Payday 2. So this entire lot... I purchased for a total of $240, which is a lot considering it is Xbox 360, but I did sell one a while back, the same console, Xbox 360 Elite. This console here, bundling it with a couple games, I should be able to get $150 out of that. That's what I sold the last one for, so I'm expecting around the same. The games, obviously I'm going to have to look up certain ones to see what the sold comps of them are. A lot of these I might list on eBay, starting bid around $5 plus shipping. See what happens with those. The ones that are three games like Bioshock 1, 2, and Infinite, I might bundle those together, put them on eBay. I'm also going to be listing and bundling them on Facebook Marketplace and Kijiji as well, because those at least I wouldn't have to pay 
uh, any kind of shipping for. But definitely I'm expecting roughly $5 each video game, and that right there would be instant profit, not including what I sell the console for. For $240, if you divide that by 76, that's basically like I paid $3 each game, plus I got the Xbox 360 for free, included in the lots. So whenever I price it out like that, even if I sell them at $5 each, that right there is $140 profit, plus the $150 I'm expecting for this game. That is amazing. That is $290 profit if I do sell them the way that I'm thinking, where at least I'll get hopefully $5 each game plus $150. That would be amazing. So I spent $240, but if I do sell them that way and I do get $290, that, at the end of the day, is amazing. And some of these games, obviously, that's my bare minimum is $5 each. But some, like I did say, Dante's Inferno, that one is a $15 game. So I know I'll be able to sell it for $15. If there's any others that are worth more than 5 bucks, obviously, they'll be going to go on uh, eBay. And I'm going to list them like that. The War Games, I might bundle all of them together on a lot on eBay, which might be able to get more money and be able to sell those quicker. And one thing I'm really happy with, there's only, out of the 76 games, there's only three sports games, which I try to avoid sports games all the time, but definitely profit to be made. The bare minimum is about $50 profit, which is great for me. And it only goes up from there. If I can get more than $5 each game, the profit will go up. But to me, that is a great deal and something definitely to look out for whenever you're out, especially when it comes to the Xbox 360. If it is just the Xbox 360 Slim, I usually sell those for around 100 maybe with 5 to 7 games, as long as it has a controller and then all the power cords and everything. But for the Elites, should be able to get 154 like I did for the last one that I sold. So anywhere between $50 plus dollars profit, I will gladly take that. Hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I love sharing the things that I pick up to sell on eBay and how much I paid for them, and what I'm expecting to flip them for. And that's why I like making this series, and that's why I like buying and selling. My reselling business is definitely taking off, and I just love sharing all of that with you guys. So hope you guys enjoyed today's video. I'm going to leave this here. Please take care. Peace.